What's up guys, it's a blooming guy and welcome back to a long-awaited Pokemon Septo Conquest. It's been a while, I know, but we are back because a lot of people actually like the series. Although this game, ROM hack, whatever you want to call it, is kind of um, unfavorable. And let's just get into another battle with these yellow people. And by that, I mean people wearing yellow clothes, which is not in any form or type of racism in any way. But whatever. Alright, Magneton versus Fire Red. Why did I name him Fire Red for? No, eh, whatever. So it's just a standard battle. And of course... One thing I do have to say, though, is that the AI in this game is a lot more aggressive than in any simple Pokemon game. Uh, Sonic Boom used to be the fear back in Red and Blue. Always confirmed, like, 20%, I think. So, finally, I'm in Ember, Blaze, whatever you want to call it. And that should be one-shotted. Which it is. Decent amount of XP. Um, so I'm guessing all these people are pos possessed. Yeah, all these people are pretty much possessed. And the fact that this... I don't know if the this Rama can really handle it, because, oof, look at that. Oof, ah, oh, that's bad. And I'm also, wait, that's, that's a death sentence right there. Why would I go into the menu and stuff? This game loves to glitch out when I'm in a menu. Well, I guess all these people have the same dialogue. But... The good news is that guy's hand is all clunky and messed up. So that's not an electric Pokemon. Uh, so I'm going to call BS on you. I'm just going to call BS. That's not an electric Pokemon. What are you doing in this team? Oh. And poison gas has to hit, right? Okay. Let me see. What can I do about that? Nothing really. Smoke screen. Hitting him with the 420 though. <laughs> Alright. I can say that I'm a little upset. I can say that. Confused and poison? I'm I'm not dealing with this. Let's try Jessica again. And I'm I'm guessing that's smart to use meditate when Drowsy's actually a special attacker. I mean, that was a threat in, I guess, first gen, but... Oh, I see what you did there. But, because you're all up in the 420 right now, you're not going to be hitting me, I hope. Yeah! Drowsy 420. Drow, and then Z with three, like, two threes, or three threes. 420. And now it's gone. And Fire Red leveled up, cool. I think I should keep Jessica as Pikachu. And just try and beat this really, really annoying game. With Jessica. Why not? And he's poison. Okay. I guess I'll level Jessica up as well next. Damn my lack of speech. Okay. That's nice. So, I mean, you could still paralyze an electric type, which I find dumb. How do you paralyze an electric type, though? If I can't use Leech Seed on a grass type, what makes you think I can use Thunder Wave on another electric type? That needs to be, like, fixed or something in next gen. And speaking of next gen... Sorry about Chespin evolution, people. It's just... Uh... Just all... Just all kind of nasty. Looking like that thing. That green thing. Spiky thing that falls from the tree sometimes. That. But... I think... I mean, I thought... I would choose, uh, Froakie. Simply because... I go by design of third evolution. I don't go by anything else. I'm not that type of person that, oh, I started with Bulbasaur, so I'm going to 
keep starting with grass types or you know some of those people you know they do that uh i go with the coolest looking third evolution because i thought blastoise looked badass and second gen i thought type i used i picked all three of them like i started a new game after i got like the third evolution which i don't know what's wrong with me but i did and i picked typhlosion because for alligator was like meh and meganium was garbage to me uh third gen i picked well the farthest i've got i got i remember getting sept to like level 90 and then just stopping uh blaziken didn't really appeal to me that much so i guess swampert and then eventually that mudkip thing became a meme so that's even cooler uh, fourth gen was Turtwig. Uh, I didn't go by third, I went by first that time, but in the end, it still turned out pretty cool. Torterra was really awesome with the continent, whatever type Pokemon it is, and with the tree on its back, that was awesome. And fifth gen, I picked Tepig into Embor because Embor's shiny final. Embor is awesome standing fire fighting whatever you want to call it so good and the shiny design was even more badass this gen i'm looking at froki for now but if fennekin or whatever the second evolution manages to take the stick out of its hot rear end and maybe look cooler or if chessman's evolution manages to man up or if froki just stays like an awesome frog i mean still it's to be awesome and there goes a ghastly cry. But overall, I think it was pretty awesome. What am I... I hate this. <laughs> Why have this in the game? Look at this. Dumbass puzzles. It's not even a puzzle, it's a torture device. And another battle. And I do hate you. Having to fight all these idiots. Jolteon. Now we're talking. But I mean, I might as well just leave. Because for some reason, Volt Absorb might pick up the Thunder Wave. For some reason, I feel as though it will. So let's go Fire Red. Double Kick. It's not going to do that much, but I am in Blaze right now, so that's good. But. I don't want to risk it since Jolteon is way faster than me. Yeah, I guess you're just going to keep... I guess you have no stab moves then? Well, I can see what kind of trainer you... Alright. I can see what kind of trainer you are now that you sand attack me. <sighs> I didn't do much. Hey, there's Blaze. Come on. Wow. Okay, so Blaze didn't kick in. And I'm getting sand attacked. Fire Red's on. <sighs> I have a lot of Pokemon weak to electric types. Maybe I should invest in a ground type. Like Dugtrio. Maybe. And when do I get Fly in this game? I need Fly. I need Fly so bad. I want to go back and then catch all three starters. And just let them sit there. Because I think... Well, one of my friends believes that if you have all three starters, you basically beat the game. Which is, I guess, half right? Or a half truth, kind of? Because in yellow version, if you had all three starters, you were pretty much set, including Pikachu. Uh, I can I can kind of say that at one point, in uh, when I was in the Sinnoh region, I had all three starters, and I didn't really have a difficult time doing anything. The, depending on what you pick for your last three, you'll have a great time or you'll have like you'll be struggling. For me, I was having a really awesome time just burning through a lot of the, the trainers and all that stuff. So here they give you an opportunity for you to get all three starters because you know there's wild Pokemon everywhere. But the question is where am I gonna get fly from? I should be getting fly now. Uh, and I checked back at that house where the bike thing was and it was just Lance and 
I guess he wants golden teeth, but I'm not even at the safari zone at this point in time. But I have to get there eventually. At least. Yeah. Yeah, yellow pirates. <laughs> chin chow. What is a chin chow anyway? Has like two yellow things just sagging there. And I didn't consider him having Vold Absorb. Or does it have Illuminate? Or does Illuminate even exist here? Alright, so since... Yeah, okay, so now that's confirmed. Uh, at least it's good to know that I can paralyze things with a, you know, Thunderbolt. And I guess sparks are coming. Focus Sash. And you paralyze an electric type. That's nice. So I'm going to switch. <sighs> Why is everything linked to electric on my team? Bad clay dollar. Yeah, I should have. <sighs> Ghost Armory. Oh, yeah, be, be dumb. Please keep being dumb. Keep it going. There we go. Cool. That's okay. More repels. Oh, yeah, because that's going to... But I mean, I do need to use this. But that's not going to keep away. Well, Pokemon, I need to use a repel. But let me just fix up Jessica right quick. I won't forget it. All right, just beat that thing real quick. So now... Where's the... There. Super Repel. So Jessica leveled up. Back to my starter. I always like doing that, putting the starter up front. And of course, it's... who goes there? Just, just... Alright, skip that fight, because this was getting a little tedious. I will see you guys in the next part of Dead Man's Castle, Septo Conquest. Catch you later!